The open wheel modified is getting set to go for their 30 lap feature tonight on September 15, 2012. 30 laps the distance for these open wheel ground pounders. Starting grid's gonna look like this, just like the front row in heat race number two earlier this evening. Mike Miller and Russ Miller are gonna flank each other. Row number two, Terry Fisher Jr. in car number four, and then it's the 80 of Ralph Baxter the third. Row three, the driver that's got two straight modified feature wins, that's Mike Mays. And then the 89 of John Gatton Jr. Pete Wormcastle, Steve Menick Jr., Mike Bufink, Rick Coe, Corey Coulardo, Steve Schlater Jr., Alan Fox, and Matt Dimmitt, your starting field. Speedway Hall of Famer Cliff Setzer, unfortunately not going to make the call for this feature event, but a good-looking field of modifieds getting set to go. Keep an eye on Mays. The driver will start fifth. He's got four feature wins here this season. He's going to go for another one. Set for 30 laps. Here we go at Bearfield Speedway. Miller and Miller bring him to green. Mike Miller in 65 out of the race lead. Terry Fisher Jr. goes into second. Russ Miller starting to drop back. Mike Mays is already up to third. Ralph Baxter and John Gatton get into it. Gatton with problems. Problems for Gatton in the 89. That car is going to go to the pit area. Gatton already out of it. Top break for him. Juniors, two sons, Jonathan and Jordan, won both their feature events over on the dirt track last night. Mike Mays already up in a second. Mays in a second. Fisher back to third. Warmcastle trying to close in. Pete Warmcastle battling with Terry Fisher Jr. for a top three spot. Ralph Baxter solidly in fifth. Steve Medic Jr. sixth. Mike Mays, the 72. Gonna clear Mike Miller for the race lead. Castle gonna shoot in a second. Miller back to third. Baxter trying to get around Terry Fisher Jr. for a top four spot. Menick trying to come up the field as well. Rick Coe battling with Russ Miller. This is the battle for seventh on the racetrack as Rick Coe gonna clear him. Up for fifth, Steve Menick Jr. trying to get down to the inside of Terry Fisher Jr. Ralph Baxter the third getting around Mike Miller. That's for a third. up to fourth, Mike Miller back to fifth. Now sixth is Terry Fisher Jr. gonna get back around him. Top two under a blanket is Wormcastle trying to close in on Mays. Mike Mays still holding off Wormcastle. Mays trying to make it a three-peat. He's got the last two feature event wins. Here at Bearfield Speedway with the Modifieds. Ralph backs to the third, sitting in third, trying to hold off Steve Menick Jr.
Steve Minnick Jr. trying to hound around the 80 machine of Ralph Baxter the third. All alone in fifth, the four machine of Terry Fisher Jr., a star on the ARCA CRA Super Series. Mike Miller sitting in sixth. in the pack, Coulardo, Schlater, and Russ Miller all going at it. Corey Coulardo and Steve Schlater Jr. continuing to battle. Battle still for third. Ralph Baxter holding his own against the points leader, Steve Minnick Jr. Ralph Baxter the third. Still holding off Minnick. Minnick having fits. Sitting in the fourth position, trying to get past Baxter and the lat vehicle of Matt Dimmitt, while the top two, Mays and Wolfcastle, continue to streak away. Baxter and Minnick still battling third and fourth. Fisher rounds out the top five. Battle starting to heat up for the lead. Wormcastle closing in on Mays. Mays and Wormcastle still battling it out as they're going to close in on the slower vehicle on Mike Boofing. The 72 machine of Mike Mays. They've had a for sale sign on this race car all season. It's a wonder nobody's bought this thing yet. As good as this thing has been running lately, it's a wonder that nobody's bought it, and it's a wonder that the team is even selling it. Mays still out in front of Warpcastle. So in the nine, starting to fade a little bit. Mays starting to open up a pretty good lead as Mays clears Boofink. Now Warmcastle going to try to clear Boofink as well. Battle still for third. Menick trying to get around Baxter. Baxter holds off Medic. Five laps to go from Jeff Hardy Sr. high atop the flag stand. Best battle on the racetrack here for third. Medic trying to get around Baxter. Race leader Mike Mays going to try to clear Russ Miller. Mike Mays has cleared the slow machine of Russ Miller try to get another win here at Bearfield Speedway. Two laps to go for the little red hot rod of Mike Mays. He's got 
three feature wins here this season in these 30 lappers, and of course the big one at the Gold Cup, Napa Twin 50s at the end of July. This is gonna be some great momentum as we head to Sunoco Season Championship night next week, right flag in the air. The Napa Auto Parts, JC Automotive, Bennett's Pit Stop, Little Red Hot Rod, a Mike Mays, final couple of corners. Give it a three, Pete, Mike Mays. Rounds going to number three and four, and back to victory lane. Mays does it again. Warm Castle second, coming to the line for third. A fantastic run for Ralph Baxter. Medic fourth, coming to the line for fifth, gonna be Terry Fisher, Jr.